What's up guys, it's Parzival here, and I'm continuing my Let's Play on Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. Uh, last time we left off, we finished the, uh, oh, we finished up Atlantica, and we came to Hollow Bastion and saw that there was some trouble afoot, so we had to come to the Postern and see if we can find Leon and go talk to Tron. Um, before we start off, though, I have a little confession to make. Uh... After the last episode, I went and did a little bit of grinding. I was at about level 42, I think, and I, I went a little nuts. So uh, now I'm actually up at level 75. Um, <laughs> I'm I'm sorry if uh if that's like way too high, but I did get kind of carried away. I was watching Twitch and grinding, and I I actually like to grind, so I wasn't even really paying attention to it. So yeah, I kind of overdid it a little bit, but I did get some uh, cool stuff. Um. The one main one that I'm going to show you is, uh, where is it? Uh, Berserk Charge. It increases your strength by 2 during MP Charge and enables combos to continue endlessly. The combo, finish, the combo finishing move becomes unavailable. So basically you have an infinite combo. And I kind of like it, because uh, it also increases your damage and it's pretty good. I don't think it did that in the first game. Um, I also got a, uh, where was it? I got some other stuff, but... And I also, uh, I was able to really stock up on some elixirs too so uh i think i ended up getting like 30 of them all right so um <coughs> i'm sorry uh yeah sorry about that but that's just kind of how i play games um let me know in the comment section below how you feel about grinding because i personally like it i i like to be over leveled because if i'm i mean i do like a challenge but if i'm really struggling in something then I'm not really having that much fun with it, but there are times where I have uh, been known to be a bit over-leveled. I mean, look at how quickly we're taking these guys out, uh, except for that guy. Um, yeah, we got a lot of strength increases and a lot of uh, a lot of synthesis items and main, basically all the ones from uh, from. Um, the Pride Lands. I didn't grind any place else because the Pride Lands had so much experience to it. That was another reason why I went kind of overboard with it. Um, but I got a lot of stat increases, so hopefully that'll help a bit. Um, I wish I had a, a stronger magnet because that was the, the main source of my uh, of my grinding. But oh well. But yeah, let me know how you feel about that. I mean, when I played uh, Final Fantasy VII for the first time, I was like way over leveled for that Sephiroth fight because all I ever heard was this this fight took me forever and blah 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 and stuff like that. I'm like, screw, hey, another elixir. I'm like, screw that. That's not going to be me. So I got all my characters. I had Cloud, Sid, and Vincent in my party, and I got them all up to level 96 before I took on Sephiroth, and it took like two rounds of Knights of the Round and it was over. It was kind of, kind of ridiculous. Gosh, it's only us. You can't you can't talk to Tron if you're if this room gets taken over. Did you check with Sid? Uh-huh. And the eradicator? It's almost done. Great. Say Leon, why don't you go work with Sid? I have this place under control. Oh yeah, right, Aerith. Are you sure? All by yourself? Hrumph. Er, sorry, it's all yours. How's Tron? We still can't get in touch with him. Maybe you guys should give it a shot. No, we'll go talk to him in person. Then I have a favor to ask. When you find Tron, can you tell him to, to come to the I.O. Tower? That's where the we'll upload the MCP eradication program. The I.O. Tower, got it. Thanks, and watch your backs. Oh, we always do. We always do, Leon, don't you worry. Oh, and we got a new Keyblade, the Sleeping Lion, a well-balanced well -balanced with strength and magic, increasing maximum ground-based combos by one. I think I might equip that, I kind of like it. We'll be there soon, Tron.
All right, in that useless cutscene, now we are going to go in and we are going to go to the pit cell. Gorge, hope Tron's okay. Me too. Let's head for the game grid. Great. The terminal works. Let's go! Alright, so like you said, we're going to go ahead and head for the game grid, but I want to swap Keyblades really quick because I want to show off the Sleeping Lion. It's, uh, it's pretty good. It takes my strength down one, but it puts my magic up two, so I think I'm going to use that. And it looks kind of cool, especially in this Tron stuff. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, so let's go on to the game grid. Finished? Would be, if it weren't for the old loon's magic. Old loon, you say? I'm trying to work here. No, <laughs> I'll show you who's old. Done! Yeah! There you go, Leon. One homemade program. A loony wizard special. This had better work. I'm off. Be on your guard. All right, so it looks like we got to take out some baddies really quick. All right, defeat all the Heartless. You know, easy enough. All right, so one good thing about... uh, Oop, that's not what I wanted to happen. Um, one good thing about me being a little overleveled was that it'll probably make these worlds go by a little bit quicker. But even though this is actually the last world before we take on the, the actual finishing the story, but still, nonetheless... Oh, nice job, Donald. Oh yeah, they're also really OP now too, so that's good. <laughs> you really saved me. Don't mention it. What's going on here? The MCP is ready to wage all-out war against the users. What's been happening on the outside? Well, there's this machine making Heartless. It's gone totally berserk. The town's control system is having problems too. But Sid's putting together a program that can de-res the MCP. Once we pick it up at the I.O. tower, he thinks he can use it to stop the MCP for good. Let's try it. Great. 
So who's this Sid? He's a friend of ours. <clears throat> They're all on the outside worrying about you, Tron. Oh, I missed all their names. You know what their names are. I must have a lot of user friends. You sure do. That program ought to be done by now, don't you think? To the tower! Let's go! Alright, we have Tron, and we're going to switch him in with Donald. Mainly because I have a, um... I have an ability now for Goofy that's called uh, Quick Change, I think. And uh, whenever Donald or Tron uh, passes out, it'll automatically switch in Goofy. So that's pretty cool. Um, so I'll keep Donald and Tron in there because I'm sure that Goofy will come in at some point. Um, even though, like I said, stop it. Even though, like I said, we're pretty OP. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? We just die? There we go. I wanted your stuff. Good old lucky lucky. Alright, so the IO tower, I'm not gonna... I'm already pretty overpowered, so I'm not gonna waste your guys' time with these guys. Alright, so here we go, heading to the IO tower hallway. Alright, so again, we have to uh, take out some Heartless. So we gotta defeat all the Heartless and then head over to the IO Tower. So I'm just gonna try and use some Magnet so I can take these guys out quickly. Um, stop! Wow, I really hate that freaking move. Look, you're stuck in a Magnet now. You can't even do anything. Really? That didn't do anything to him? I can't do anything. That's bull. There we go. Alright. Who else wants some? Huh? Huh? You want some? Oh yeah, he's he doesn't it doesn't work with that. I forgot. Stop! My god. This is craziness. Oh, thanks. I'm glad I put that stuff on. Okay, so yeah, these guys are being like hella annoying right now. So I'm gonna try see if I can try some air combos with them instead. Oh my god, what is with these guys? Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. There we go. Took him out. See if I can... There we go. Okay, I should just use Thunder on those guys, because that is freaking annoying. <laughs> My god. Alright. I don't know why I did that. I don't think I needed to. Let's just head for the IO Tower. <laughs> Man, I'm just off today. I think I'm too used to being a little tiny lion. Warning. User control is terminated indefinitely. <sighs> no good. Leon, let me try. This is your final warning. Stop at once. Bon appétit. Don't talk with your mouth full. What? What are you loading? Nothing's come in yet. Leon, come on! There. All right!
What's it like? This is very strange. That's more than Spartrek. Huh? There's a power booster for me. And flight routines for the solar sailor. Meaning we're set? Well, like you users say, we won't know till we give it a try. We'll need a sailor to reach the MCP, so let's get to the simulation hangar. Alright, so Tron learned a new ability, so let's go ahead and see if we can check out what that new ability is. Hopefully equip it. He is level 75 now, he's probably got a little bit of AP to spend. Alright, let's see. Let's see what he's got. Alright, so Tron new ability is oh we got a thunder boost that's pretty good and mp haste so hmm i'm gonna keep on this this stuff i can probably take off jackpot though and i'm gonna put on a thunder boost because all of his attacks are thunder based so let's go ahead and use that and we need to get to the simulation hangar so uh i'm trying to remember exactly where that is it should be out here somewhere i, I mean i don't know we'll see <laughs> Well, I'm sure, I'm totally sure that we'll get to it. Alright, screw you guys. Goodbye. Okay, I, I think this might, yep, this is the way, right here. This is the only way we haven't been yet. Yep, simulation hangar, there we go. Alright, so I'm going to say screw you to these guys. And we are going to head on, on to the solar sailor, which is pretty cool. And we got a, we got a sticker, oh snap. I haven't checked those things in so long, why did I do that? I don't know why I did that. Alright, back on. This is far from a simulation, we're actually standing on a solar sailor. So we gotta come over here and we gotta depart, but it's going to give us a little minigame, too. You've got to keep a lookout. The MCP isn't going to just let us waltz in. Okay, so the problem with this is that there's too much weight on the uh, sol on the uh, solar sailor, so we actually need to get rid of some weight. I'm gonna use a. Uh, Where's Tron? I want to use setup. All right, so you need to make sure that that bar on the on the left doesn't doesn't increase any. Um, I'm gonna do this because it's going to have a uh, another security program come out that's gonna help us. Hey, we can, why not? We got another level up. Um, that's gonna help us take care of some of this weight too. So uh, it'll it'll take it out pretty pretty well too. I mean, it's kind of crazy. So just go ahead and. Uh, take out as much as you can and and that that limit actually took out more than you may think um and we're also like super strong right now so this is definitely good okay so there's they, they're saying that there's too much weight so but really we haven't even gotten to 25 percent yet stop it you jerk yeah. all right take him out i can't believe i got another thing oh i learned explosion i'm definitely going to be putting that on that's a really good uh finishing combo The MCP is straight ahead. Time to settle things for good. Alright, so you guys noticed that we got a couple chests here. Uh, more than a couple, we got four of them here. Um, I'm going to put on um, Explosion really quick. Uh, 
Oh, I don't have enough for it yet. Unleash is a finishing move that knocks down several enemies. Damage dealt is relative to magic skill. It's going to be really good for us because we have really high magic. So I'm going to take off one of these draws because I don't really need two draws. And I'll put on explosion. It's going to be really cool. Okay, and... We will open this and find an Orchalcum Plus. Do not forget to open these up. Oh, look, an AP boost. Perfect. Okay, I believe that this one is going to be... Ah, this is Cosmic Arts, of course. Okay, so highly increases strength and magic and extraordinarily increases maximum AP. We're going to put that on Sora in just a second. And this should be a map of the area. Yep, Control Computer Core map. Alright, so I am going to equip... Probably for the Chaos Anklet... Where was it? Oh, no, it wasn't on this. It was one of these, right? Yeah, Cosmic Arts. There we go. Alright, so that's going to not increase my strength, but it will increase my magic. Uh, that'll increase my strength, but not my magic, and this will increase both. So let's go ahead and put the Cosmic Arts on this one. There we go. Now that's thinking smart. Alright, so let's head on and confront the MCP. Who is that? Sark, the MCP's number two. Tenacious little bugs. Your time is up. Prepare for de-resolution. Alright, so we're going to be taking on Sark, and this uh this is actually two phases of a fight. So this will be phase one. Uh he'll he'll have some heartless. You want to mostly focus on him, though, if you can. Oh, nope. Never mind, you can't. He's going to be teleporting around all, all over the place like a real jerk. Let's see if I can show explosion. No, oh, it didn't show explosion. That kind of stinks. Um, come on. Give me explosion. I want to show the people what you have. I guess I didn't put it on. Never mind. I mean, I did, right? I thought that it was something else, but never mind. Um... Alright, so yeah, all you gotta do is just, uh, right now, take out Sark. He's, he's not very strong right now, but that will change. Um, all he does is teleport around like a douche. Oop. There we go. Nice little thunder took him out with my thunder boost. You're very persistent, Tron. I'm also better than you. Uh, we would have made a great team. Now for the MCP. This thing is the MCP? That's it. Ugly, isn't it? Tron, don't you understand? We don't need users. We've advanced. They're superfluous. Be a part of me, and together the world will be ours to control. MCP. You still don't get it, do you? Sark! Sark! Functions are now yours. Alright, so he's really big now, uh, and we and we now have to take down Sark and the Master Control program. So, um, what you need to do here is you take down his feet, and once you take down his feet, he's going to come down and you can go ham on his head. Now, you need to get him all the way down to zero in order to progress. Uh, almost got it, dang. Alright, ooh, that's a lot of vicinity break holy crap 
Alright, so he's going to be down now. And when that happens, the shield around the MCP is going to stop. Now, when that when that happens, you need to take down one of these uh, one of these panels, and uh, if you can, I mean, geez. Wow, are you kidding? There we go. Okay, so once the panel is done, then you're going to. Damn it, that's not what I wanted to do. Ugh. I knew that this was going to uh, be a problem. Okay, so I got nothing on that one. Just go ahead and take down take down a panel again. Oh, I don't have a finishing move. There we go. Okay, so you're going to use Tron and you're going to take away some of the Master Control program's health by mashing triangle. Sorry if you can hear it in the uh, in the microphone, but I am mashing pretty hard. <clears throat> and then Sark is going to come back to life. Uh, or is he? He's not. All right, so I believe that it was over here. Yep, here we go. So we're going to delete some more from over here uh, because I'm not going to spend the time to try and uh, I'm not going to spend the time to try and um, break another one just yet. All right, so I need to make sure that I don't do setup because that was really freaking annoying. Um, if you do use setup on Sark right here, it should pretty much take him out in one try. So you can use it as a strategy here, and then you won't have to worry about it then. But I'm not going to uh, worry about it too much right now. Um, because we're kind of powerful, so it should be okay. Uh, and I want to have a uh, finishing combo for right here, so that I can take one of these things out. Okay, that didn't work. That also didn't work. Okay. So, l let's see if we can still take this out. Okay, there we go. Now, delete. That's what I want. Oh, and I got healed. Thanks, Donald. Alright, so it should be, like, maybe two more phases of this. Um, I seriously doubt I'll be able to get this out in the next one. Um, all right, he's going to turn this around again. And uh, I think we can try and see if there is another gap. Um... Where was it? Ah, it's right here. Okay. So we're going to delete again. We're going to be able to get a little bit more off. Probably not all that much, though, because Sark should be coming back soon. And this should only take one more one more try. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, heal. And hopefully, hopefully this still works. There's a lot of stuff going on right now. So, um... Alright, so I should be able to take him down because of my increased strength right now, and the fact that I, uh... Oh, I almost got him, okay. And the fact that... I thought that the fact that I had the increased strength would have helped out a little bit there. Um, alright. And... Come on down, so I can hit you again. Uh, do I need to do a finisher on you? That really sucks. Okay. Um... <laughs> so that's unfortunate, but there we go, took him out. Oh, and perfect, it stopped right here, exactly where I wanted it to be. So this should be able to delete all of the MCP. Hopefully we can get there, come on, just a little bit more. Come on, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Yes, there we go. We got a maximum HP increase and the reflect element leveled up. That is awesome. I see Tron has a silly side, too. I learned it from you. Of course, I do have my silly limits. Okay, then I'll tweak your program when I get back to the user world. You? Maybe we better not try that. Oh, how about it, guys? Singing Tron? Dancing Tron. Sound good? <laughs> okay, okay, fine. But before I crash... Sora, Donald, Goofy, and all the users out there... Thank you. You really helped me. You made me so much stronger. You taught me what friendship is truly all about. 
and I'll never forget it. As soon as I met you, I knew we were going to defeat the MCP and free the system. Isn't this what users do when they're sorry to say goodbye? Uh, it's a first for me. Gorge, Tron, it's like a promise that we'll see each other again real soon. Okay, well then. I promise. Where are you going? Oh. <laughs> Tron! are settling down in town. The only Heartless left anywhere are the local variety. And it looks like there are fewer than before. Now if we can just get those three back in one piece... You're here! Welcome back! How's the town? A-OK! -okay. Not a single trace of the MCP, either. Everything's back to normal. We made it. Hey, why the long face? What happened? Tron just disappeared. And he promised we'd see him again. Run! What's happening? Greetings, friends. System is up and ready for user input. Tron! Tron! Stay in touch. Yeah. I'm right out boy! Hey, stop that. It tickles. Tron is ticklish? How about this? Please, stop that. <laughs> <laughs> I think Tron's been hanging around those guys too much. Wait, wait, just a moment. I want to show you something I dug up from the system archives. You can see the town back when it was first built. That's right. I remember now. Just like the old days. Hmm. I'd be fascinated to ascertain as to when the town got such a dreadful name as Hollow Bastion. You know, this town had another name once. Hmm?
Bye, Halabastion, and hello, Radiant Garden. All right, and with that, we have finished things off in uh, in Radiant Garden, um, which is now what the name of the town is. So it's pretty cool that it changes like that. It's a much nicer name than Hollow Bastion, and we were able to do that for them. So that's pretty cool. Um, this is kind of a long episode. I probably should be splitting it into two uh, episodes, but I don't think I will. I feel like I have enough uh, videos to up or to upload for you guys. Um, yeah, and there's just like minimal things to do still in uh in Radiant Garden. It's gonna be hard saying uh saying Hollow Bastion and uh or not saying Hollow Bastion anymore because I've said it for two games. And uh yeah, so we're back in Radiant Garden. So um yeah.